Titan Shiro has taken down Ray. That's early. Look at the nade damage. Preparation already paying dividends. Brokey recovers a little double headshot. Off of the flashbang. Carrigan needs one now. Gets nothing done. And Spirit off to the races. Seems way too... Also be somewhere around the corner is Zontix. Heads up maneuver. He's going into this. It comes a difficult angle to clear. If he can even get one, it's huge. It's massive from Zontix. Found by Robs. Still no rotation down towards B. They should be able to get it for free and plant this bomb. That's the call. Low sight taken. Chopper down the vents. It's a risk he's taking. Bomb has been planted. And now the bomb is ticking. A lot hangs in the balance of this next exchange. Donk has a kit. Does he have a frag? Does he have anything to contribute here, or do they just have to back it up? Chopper on the decon loses his head. Force wide is Brokey. Burned down. Donk on a double. Found by Ray. It's still Shiro stopping from behind his rock. It's not planted for him. And what a retake this could be. A 10 second defuse. Can he get there in time? He's going to run. Knife out. Running him down. Try and take this space as quick as you like, and oh my lord. He's done it again. Donk, an opening kill this time to start. Faze Khan from getting across his ninth frag, four rounds deep. Kid's omnipresent. Well, uh, yeah, the chance of resetting Team Spirit's just gone down the gurgler. They were hoping to get all that space, and they're just challenging Yarn. Two through the smoke, one for Shiro. Uh, this one's been stumped. Yeah, that was what they took the time out for. Halley said, yeah, when they do the smoke wall again, Don, could you just kill two of them through the smoke without seeing that? would be great. I mean, this kid, as you know, the name of the baby goat. But this kid, something special. He is the truth right now on the stage. Look at him go! Working his magic. Look at that infectious smile. The conversation can't be all about him, can it? Because during the group stage, I see Spirit just having their way with everybody. And I'm like, this isn't going to be the case, is it? Spirit aren't just going to win the event, and Dom's not just going to be the best player in the world, is he? It really? Is that how this is going to go down? How can you argue with this start? 11 to 1. <laughs> Contact. Timing. Oh, that time. incendiary. It's Rob's with the bomb trap now, safe in the corner from the spread. Committing through. Chopper, if he wins this duel in combination from Dunk, they're locking it down on Nuke. Frozen. A double of his own design and 40 seconds to do the impossible. Right this ship for FaZe Clan. A clutch from Rops already, getting them there first. Bomb on that top side. They're not in their bedrooms anymore. Listen to that. Focusing on closing this one out and... Having their way with FaZe right now. Nothing working for FaZe Clan. Early days. Yeah, expectations. Look, if they can get themselves up to four or five rounds on the T side of Nuke, What's they're still this? in the conversation. Zontix, he wants to do some heavy HE damage combined with a nice spray. Oh, the timing is immaculate. He'll only get the one. It's a big frag to post. Here we go. FaZe Clan and their pistols. A brutal and potent combination. And everyone gets one. Bar frozen. It's almost a team ace. It might have to be Brokey who steps up for the double. And Spirit were ready, but the round's going their way. Bomb ticking. And Chopper resigning himself to try and maintain. And finances aren't great on every member of Spirit right now, so Chopper will have to try and hold on to this A4. In fact, they broke through ramp there just as that HE came into play. A massive shot from Brokey to deal with Shiro, who leers out. Gets his head ripped off, and then there's so many gaps. Rain gets a kill towards Yard. Carrigan strolling out the squeaky door. There's so much chaos. So we've had a 1v2 situation. Rob's coming down to the tiniest of margins to secure that. Oh, there it is again. Rain up and over. Dom goes down.
Janko was highlighting the proactive nature of Spirit on Anubis. Had some highlights to show, and now in a number disadvantage. On Nuke, you've got a few options. Turtle up and towards the sides, maybe take a gamble or look for a fight. And Zomtix with the molly in his face. Can't really contribute to this yard hold. They've decided to gamble three. Chopper main, Shiro towards Hell, and Zomtix Whoa. from that secret position. Just look at and admire how that utility isolates this setup. Oh, they've cleared it. They think it's clear. He's looking for his window of opportunity, his rain. Another smoke. It feels like they've got infinite utility here, FaZe. Everything well placed. Looking for Rantas' chopper, and he's gonna ooh, get a rude shock as he crosses back, fired off a warning shot to Frozen. Mantles up and finds the head of Frozen. That's a big one from Chopper. He stands and delivers, loses his life eventually, and loses his sight. Surely the save call from Shiro and Zoxix. Has to be. Unless he wants to poke his head up that unbroken vent. Yeah, but you know Rain's built different. He'll handle that with class. Now, going to be 2,900 as the loss bonus into the next. So if these two save, they'll be able to drop silence down fours, and then I'm sure Magix will operate on something lighter yet again. So Team Spirit, they hold on for the next 20 or so seconds. Should see themselves into another sizable buy, but will Halley take another tactical timeout? Last time he did, they got back into the winning ways. But then the same for Neo. Feels like we've had uh, one-way traffic ever since Neo took that timeout. To leave with the lead, flashing close, looking for answers is Rain. And they got five rounds on this map in group stage, Alex. They've already done better than that. They've been doing their homework, and too many bodies. Karakut tries to tame the spray, one back from Robs. It's a double kill, looking for Zontix as well. A two versus two, but look, here comes Shiro, and it's only Robs. Magix with that rifle, a single bullet could do it. Doesn't opt for brute force, knowing his opponent has an advantage. Seven bullets in the magazine from Magix. If he gets flustered, it could get awkward. Full focus in this grand final, opening map. Rops has disappeared. Or oh, has he? Yes! He's heard a lot. And he's done it again! Oh, shocking! A headshot into Shiro. Rops, he rides the ship. Now, Carrigan does have to hold on to this. He's being tested in his test by Donk. A quick click of the Glock. For another double. These multi-kills. So comfortable for him to find in the meantime. Frozen four frags, make it five. He's been quiet. Finds his voice in the pistol. Not contending with Donk. Does he go the same way as Brokey? Oh, makes a meal of that. Thinks twice. Thinks the run away as they advance. They can get that bomb down. You two from Chopper as well to obscure the vision. Held by Chopper, Frozen, controlling the duel for Rantis, it's Donk in the clutch, has he got anything more to contribute? Does need a fresh clip. Rain coming from heaven, and already a beautiful headshot! It's gonna be Rain versus Donk to be the difference maker, and well, Donk's gonna hold up more kills, but if Rain can contain Yard, the smoke will fade, Frozen gets the first, Zontic's down. Rain's still got a lot of, to work with here, Donk was trying to go wide, you saw him there. Trying to hunt down Rain, look at that! An adjustment instantaneously. What is that reaction time? Yeah, Bloodlust knew exactly where he was, wanted to take the fight and delivers, and they've got this heaven space, and that provokes a reaction. So he's need to take some lobby control. So trading key pieces of the board, Rops, he's been a hero so far. He's typically hyper aware, but he's been caught off guard there. A bullet to the head of Dong, working with just 40. Turn. Yeah, they're faltering. Proactive from Carrigan. Woof! Takes down Donk. It costs him his life. The no frozen was door. So is he still lingering? And then you have Brokey with an auto shotgun. He needs to be in the right place at the right time. And currently, that's not the case. 25 seconds as they route up heaven. They drop in towards the A site. Frozen's really going to be the only one who can contribute. They should be able to get the bomb down. And they will. Covered and eliminated. Brokey. He'll fall. And what's Frozen to do? He'll find the first. He needs this one cleanly. And he has found it. Only man. Carrigan under scrutiny. He still takes down Magix. Trying to get down the vent. He's actually just hunting, jumping through the smoke onto 
Zontix. Two frags from the in-game leader, and he's not done there. He charges towards the two on the site. Donk still there, trying to handle the rotate. I missed Nade. It's actually Shiro catching Broki's aggression. Nade onto Donk, so this is chaotic, but it still can go wrong. Chopper in a clutch, fakes it out, investigated now by Rops, and down he goes. It's Carrigan that brings the fight to them. Chopper down the ladder and opens up the site. Rops only the one spirit. Kick open the front door. Has to be a save. Rain and Broki need to hold on to these rifles. They cannot give them over. 1,900 losses to the next, and in-game leaders in back-to-back -back rounds having huge impact. And both times towards that top side, just caught coming down the ladder, obliterates Carrigan. Yeah, I want to see that from Chopper's POV, because that's just instinct kicking in. FaZe are going to have to do this the hard way if they want to try and take us the distance here on map number one. Their pick in a best of five. And the fact that they're happy to go into Monk might want to wrap through and try and split A. This movement, hunting, killing, Donk, up and in. Just like that, FaZe Clan sent back to square one, sent back to spawn. Team Spirit posting 11 on their opponent's map pick to start this best of five, to set the tone. With 27 frags under his belt, another multi-kill round out of Donk. Yeah, and what I was just discussing is now the status quo of the finances for FaZe. There's nothing they can do about it. Again, just trying to hope to save. They are looking quite helpless at this juncture. And to remind everybody again, for the second time, they won the pistol in this second half. But weren't able to hold on, and they might lose these rifles as Uncle Chop Chop. Looking to take an ear or two. Rain is gone. Shiro too. He'd love to hold on to this one. Quite the other. Trying to find his form. Giving it a go. Hyper aggressive, and Dunk will laugh at him. Throws in opportunities on ticks though, has already passed through. This is some hyper aggressive move. Carrigan asleep at the wheel. How's he done that? He had six frags coming into this one, and he's just gone for a solo hero play. And the two teenagers with a double each as a response to FaZe's find. And Rob's his handiwork. Now he stands alone with nothing to do. FaZe have to dig so deep for their rounds, and then Team Spirits come so easily. Finding the gaps, hitting all the shots. And now they just need to find Rob's. God, that timing. A frustrating one for Frozen. Robs. Is it really going to be just an aggressive top? They take it whenever they want. He just walks on in. This time, it's FaZe that repel the invaders. Oh, dear, Doc. Sweeps phase under the rug. Rain is next challenge. Can't get past the spray. Shiro can. The dust will settle. The round has only just begun, and we are into a one versus two. Miraculous triple there. And oh, far enough. A warning shot does Rob. So loses his element of surprise. Initiates the plant and running at them with an MP9. Can't connect the dots. Oh, he's giving it a good go, but he's lost one already. Brokey cut down out of the round. Magic's to punch in the code. The round shortened. Rob still can't seem to find the head of Zontix. He's miraculously still standing. And phase find one. Dock down on bench. Is there a retake on the cards? Get on Carrigan. Headshot from Rain. From Chopper, they have Kitchen, but Rain, he's got the headshot. Chopper, the last to fall. Well, double swing, immediate deletion, and he's got his knife out. He wanted to try and punish, take the gap. It's delayed by the incendiary. Brokey and Carrigan immediately get their feckles up in preparation for pace. That's so much pressure they applied and forced out Util as well as the rotation. So job done. Donk knows it, and Carrigan searching elsewhere finds Chopper. Not a ready for that. What an equalizer. They headed to B, oh. yes they do. Yeah, Brokey's missed his first opportunity, won't get more of those. Again. He's still hitting shots. Brought down by Shiro. Brokey, Brokey aware he got him low. Onto Zontix. Look at Magix. And he's holding for this angle, what a shot from Zontix. Magix coming in from behind, Rain unawares. Bullet to the back of his head. Puts it all onto Robs. Freedom to plant. His first gun round, statement of intent from Spirit. Despite Carrigan's heroics. I don't know about going for this. Look at the finances. If he saves this, they could drop. They could have a much better looking buy round. Rops is going fishing right now. And you say Carrigan's heroics. Brokey has to hit one of those. 
Slow start for him on map number two, zero and four. The problems with Reigns' mouse, if that does slow him down as well, the Norwegian necessary as they're pushing into ROPS right now. How many can he take with him? There's the first. Oh, removed on the second. And ROPS. A lick of damage. Who draws first? Blood is Donk. Chopper cut down. Brokey on the reposition. Frozen activates as well. An opportunity obscured by the smoke. Is Shiro anticipating this re-aggress? Frozen, oh, spots him. It's up against the orb. Who wins this duel? Magic's pressuring as well. It's Shiro, good for it. And look at this. The bombs drop back. Donk's taking space towards B. This fight in middle has drawn so much attention. Carrigan's given up the side. The short player, Frozen's dead. He's going to try and rotate in time. 20 seconds. It's all on Carrigan. Just about made it through the window of opportunity. Mini oh, no! Carrigan can't get it done. And Magix is here to catch the rotations. Okay, Magix down through the portal, till finish it. With Carrigan's eye pressed to the scope, the barrel betrays Donk. Now the information flows only one way, and it's Carrigan's day onto Donk. Oh, oh Zontix is nade as he finds him. Just as he tried to drop the defensive smoke, if they find Frozen, it's awkward. He can't do it. And it just built beautifully into Spirit's round. Carrigan got the opening, but look how quickly the phase pieces fall. It's just rough. You've got Don going up against Carrigan on this head-to-head, -head, and Carrigan gets the better of him. You need more from Frozen there. It's a difficult position, sure. The rotation is on the way. And right now, so is the hunt. Chomp is already looking for Rops and Rain. He knows where they reside, or at least has a pretty rough idea. Rain might get the jump on him here if he continues to clear. Chopper will be below the cross. Oh, it's there. a hard adjustment. Yeah, he does get the better of him. I don't think anybody else from Team Spirit need to chase this down. 2,900, we can get two dropped M4s. That's if FaZe want to buy again, but now, fight towards middle. Yeah, Frozen and Rob's tested, and this time they pass with flying colors. That's what you need. Shut down. Returns us to an equilibrium, four to four. Zontix alone up against the whole FaZe squad. Investigating towards the ramp, Brokey needs to find the response. Yeah, even more. Now they come. A barrage of nades. Don't forget, Brokey, he's been naded down. A single bullet will finish him. They're mollying his position. Stands his ground. Still connects on the AWP. Cut down by Shiro into the site. It's Rain through the smoke. A tornado of bullets. Hailing down onto Spirit. And Chopper in the clutch. Finds the first of an impossible task. Frozen stands. Need one. Donk. Going head hunting. Rain will start to go into the line of fire. Still nails the headshot. Wins the head to head with Donk. Four versus four. All to play for. Bomb on Shiro. Shopper's joining him. Some ticks towards the palace position. Magic's this lurker now trying to puff up his chest mid. I'm gonna have a 2v4 here on A. Oh, it's frozen. Good for it. Mid no longer a threat. Shiro has found rain, but will they find Roth? He's very low HP. This could go horribly wrong for FaZe. If Roth leaves this round empty-handed, and he won't. Finding Chopper, Wallbang, trying to suppress him. Brought him low. Shiro will finish the job. They know where they both are. 15 and counting. Brokey has to nail this shot. Brokey has to nail this shot. Expended for phase just to get this mid control. Molly's going to make things hot under the collar as they go for the window boost. Rops up. Oh, Nade could ruin the day. Rops' reaction to this. Donk's not ready for it. Rops will tame the spray. Spots another. Rops has come to play. No mid round and no casualties. Poor Shiro and Magix. Has he got overlooked? That's a possibility. Worrying about ramp. This can pack a punch. Could deny it. Oh, Carrigan, he gets the bomb down, but now Magix has lost the element of surprise. With a low HP, Rain is brave. That nade's got his name all over him. He finds Frozen. Could have been something for Shiro, but he's not going anywhere near. 
That a bomb site hasn't fired a shot yet, so they don't even know that it's equipped. FaZe also need to hold on to these rifles, so I don't know how far they would like to push the issue in the pursuit of removing Shiro's purchase. But that right there, timing and Counter-Strike, it's a cruel mistress. Dog just felt that the hard way rops, avoids disaster by mere moments, and he becomes... Spam. I don't think Rain has a kill in the second half yet. That can change in an instant. Smoke towards the window, smoke. Key word for this mid exchange. First fades. Rain investigates. Deploys another. Deeper. This duo partnered up with Frozen. It's Donk on the other side of that smoke. Zontix has called mid clear. And it's Dong. Kept honest. Frozen gets the trade. Good night. Wow. Carrigan's ears are ringing. It's Brokey hitting shots. Zontix kept humble. Just the one. Magic still adjusts on Sandwich. A clutch for Frozen, perhaps. He can hold on. Inject some confidence into the phase ranks. He's going for the plant safe. There's a nade. Shiro has a HE. Hasn't gone for it. David Sonansky with three in the round. Filling the boots of twists. On the grand final stage, he dances with Shiro, closing the gap. Dancing around towards Firebox, spots him out, needs the mag. Shiro versus Frozen, and it's... Step chopper, timing, window. May not expect someone so far forward in the sandwich position. Good fight from Brokey, Donk is down. Frozen onto chopper, into the site, and smoke off. The AWP cannot contribute. That bomb's going down a whole lot earlier this time. Face that's something, and that's more from Frozen. Warning into things. Zontix clears. It's a big find. Brokey's low, and I said Rain hasn't fragged this second half. I, I think that remains true. An opportunity to change that in a compulsory round. Well, they are down 2-0 in this best of five. Rain, good angle. Oh, doesn't finish it. Chiro's shoulder baits him out, goes running and gunning. He's gone. They need to be on the bomb, and Brokey secures it. And he's going to be called in mid-clear. Or is he? Now it is. On to Rain. Frozen trades. Carrigan may overlook this forward position of Magix. Times it to perfection again. A huge contribution. A crucial one from Magix. Puts them in the lead. This is on to Frozen. Big find. Huge find. Hope reignites for FaZe. Chopper, default side, head on a swivel, it's Brokey, timing's everything, Chopper hasn't finished his meal, Brokey onto 14 HP, goes wide, covered by Rops, Magix, can he continue to lay waste to FaZe, he's caught again, it's Rops, with the double up, Zontix thrust into a one versus three, is he going to give it a look, 2400 loss into the next, not going to have a lot to operate with. Zontic's well aware of that, but still giving this one a look. Diffuse kit not there. And bottom spotted. Final round. Oh, and Shiro. The orb hasn't done a lot, but the scout has. That's a massive find. They're walking with a limp in a must-win round. And the Spodex silenced by one scout shot. Oh. And look at this immediate reaction. The desk highlighted the proactive nature of Spirit. Oh, this is heads up Counter-Strike. And look at the stack on the other side, the smoke to block the shotgun of Magix. He has been everywhere. This would be crushing. Of all the ways for it to go down, a scout, a shotgun, a menagerie of weaponry. Big on the MP9, that scout's still a threat. The flank is fast. Hold on, Chopper's doing it all right now. FaZe, they just have to count on Carrigan and Frozen. Here comes Zontix. It's going to end right here unless Frozen can do the impossible. Down a player. Chopper towards B has a flash ready. You can see him looking up from the graffiti position to support his teammates who have completely given up long. 
Cafe should be in. Oh, he's missed his chance there, Shiro. Yeah, punished. Down low. Still, though, Doc, a perpetual problem. Finding the headshot onto Frozen is now broke. He's turned to fall, and it's clean. Jump spotting. Looking for answers and headshots. It looks so easy for Donk. A double dilapidated phase. Oh, one back from Frozen. He's only one standing with just two HP. Chopper's double from the FAMAS. Thriving in the chaos. And this investment from FaZe. They were gunning for a round. Now they're gunning for something. With 30 seconds left, survival from Frozen might be integral. What can you do? Now backing off for the save, this is a miserable start to the half. Absolutely miserable. No plans in the first three rounds of play. Sure, the second was close. It came down to a one-on-one. -on -one. And this has almost been the story. Oh, Frozen, are you really going to give this a go? You, you can't brave that. Extinguish is there. He's through and he's dead. T-side overpass already starting to become a waking nightmare. Four phase clap. Flashes are good. Unloading their magazines. Frozen and Carrigan, they're combining well. How is he still alive? Frozen, nade on his head. Finishes it. Monster. Oh, and Shiro catches Frozen's excursion. It has to be Carrigan. He does strike just the once. Oh, solid hold so far from the CTs as Magix and Donk have taken the necessary steps to defend this site. With only 30 seconds, it's up to Brokey and Robs. And Zontix, the first and only victim of Robs. 20 seconds for the Orpa to make magic happen. He's feeling helpless now, and Shiro. Still utility to spare. The timing of that one, impeccable. And now it's up to Magix, goes wide. Chips away at Carrigan. Look at the molly, it's down perfectly. Rain will find it through the flames. 20 seconds. This gets awkward. Rotations here. Chopper's ready to unload his magazine. It's Magix in combination. Carrigan down next. It's too good from Donk, a double. And with 10 seconds left, what can Robs do? There's nothing for him here. He needs the instant headshot of Misha on the orb, but Magix is just playing with This isn't his third, his fourth. Kata beats the final. And he's getting cut down, opening death. Uh, the way that Carrigan's approaching these uh, rounds on the T side is desperate. His players aren't there for him. He's trying to make plays every single time. Trying to be the hero. This time it's Zontix fully flashed off. Robs has found a way in. Magic just needs to stay alive. The rotation's coming. We know how they tend to feel. Frozen and Robs spotted out. Shiro already rotates through. Heaven now occupied as well. Chip damage from the nade. Robs will find a little bit of a jump from Chopper. It's Frozen that finishes. But now, just like that, Doc happens again displayed at this event is unparalleled. Unprecedented. Brokey keeps us in a 4v4 in this pistol that essentially secures the championship. On the ropes, Robs empty-handed after his exchange. The Glock of Chopper puts him on his ass. Brokey knows he has to step up. Noise cut dead. Paranoia grows. Steps now for Brokey. Carrigan readies his aim. One is great. Two is more than enough. But it's only Zontix now. Could he silence the crowd? Oh, no! No! Zontix! It's one more click away. Brokey starts the mind game machine. Zontix perpetually in the shadow of his teammate. He doesn't care. It's the accolades. It's the silverware. That's what he wants in the bomb. You can see it right in front of him. He will only have one option. 15 and counting. Brokey making an ambitious maneuver. Zontix has not considered it a fake plant. Brokey has to surely have this one now. Brokey! The needle. Brokey saw absolutely nothing when he poked up his nose. Hey, Robs, they're coming. Rob's nose pressed to the screen. Controls his spray for only the one. It's Donk again. And now, with Zontix frag onto Brokey, it's just Carrigan and Rain. The old guard. In a two versus four, two on four. There's no way in. Kit's present, short. Shiro, though, here to lock the door. Carrigan, he's got more. Own Donk with a triple kill to put Spirit 
on championship point. Denied. Carrigan, what have you got? He's got a bullet between. To that laundry list of scalps. The Grim Reaper knocking on the doors one by one and phase. The last of four. Alex Donk has 26 kills in 16 rounds. And he may not be done just yet. FaZe most definitely are with just Robs and Brokey on either side of the map. Hope dies last. But what is hope? Delusion in the face of Team Spirit. Magix puts it together. This one's done. This one's been done. What a commanding performance from Team Spirit, Rops. You've got nothing to do. Lay down arms. He'll go down swinging. But we all know what this means. Team Spirit have done it! <laughs>